Welcome back, everybody. We're back in freeways yet again. Uh, hopefully, we're going to get around uh, the right side of the map. I know we only got through about three in the last episode, and uh, it was a little bit longer of an episode, so it was a little bit harder. Um, as you can see here, I went back and redid this uh, interchange here in the middle. Uh, we actually did not get as good of a score. We had, I believe, 233 on that weird one that I set up in episode two. Uh, but I wanted to try something else and I ended up only getting 229. I was trying to make a cloverleaf style interchange. Um, so we've got our little roundabout areas here uh, for the entrance and exit ramps. Uh, not roundabouts, but um, little turnarounds, I guess. Uh, and you can see where we had to do some weird stuff to, with these mountains in the way. But yeah, this actually did not work out as well as uh, that other interchange that I originally did. But it's only a few points of difference, so I'm just gonna leave this as it is. But yeah, let's go ahead and uh, get started working around the right-hand side of this. That's a lot of connections. <laughs> uh, let's check them out. So not much traffic, actually. Yeah, almost no traffic uh, anywhere. We can actually just get, a get away with a giant roundabout, I think. Very little traffic. Let's get all of these hooked up. Um, we could probably hook this up a few different ways. That might not be too good. That's a really sharp turn. But as you can see, there's basically no traffic going to it. So 390, that seems pretty good to me. Uh, average of 92 kilometers an hour. And uh, those other factors that I don't really understand that well, how they factor into the score. But yeah, 390 seems really good. I mean, other than just making a smaller roundabout or something, I really don't see how this could um, be more efficient than this. So we're going to go ahead and uh, call that one done. Uh, that's a really good start to this episode. Uh, hopefully it stays this easy. All right, getting a little harder. So 60 or uh, 13 north is going to 64 east. 64 east to 13 north for the major connections, and then the other stuff um, doesn't need that much actually. So first thing we're going to do is go ahead and hook up our major traffic directly. Leave a little room here in between. I think I'm going to have some uh, roads come through there. <clears throat> so let's see. I'm gonna hook up 13 South first, I think. Do something like that. And we're gonna need a uh, flyover. Let's, um, let's see, let's do it from this side first. I wanna see what it looks like. See what kind of room we have. So I'm gonna do something like that. And now, <clears throat> need to go up and around. Ooh, that's a little sharp. Eh, I may need to rework that. I should have just come to the far side and then hooked up instead of going around it. But I wanted to get to that second level so I could do that, even though that's a bit of a sharp turn. But we're just trying this out. So that's good. We still need a uh, south connection. 13 north still needs a lot of stuff. Um, so actually we're gonna do this first. Get that out of the way. And then we need one coming off this direction. All right. So that looks good, that looks good. Oh, we still need that, yeah, south connection, never mind. Uh, that's doing good. I also could have come around and hooked up over here possibly instead of through there. 
Uh, let's go ahead and hook this up, get it out of the way. And let's see where we can hook. Mm, I may need to redo this. Kind of cuts into our room that we've got right through here. Not sure where. Yeah, I don't know if I can sneak. Let me let me just go ahead and clear this real quick. Let's uh let's try and do this a little bit different. So let's have some room in there. Still want to hook it up like that. Uh, let's start down here. Hook that up. I'm gonna take that. Hook that up. Uh, what else do we need? So we need this to come down. So we're actually going to do that, I think, here. So we're gonna do that. I'm gonna take this and do that. So we got 13 South needs to go north still. And uh, also west. So 13 North already has its hookup. Little bit cramped. Uh, so let's see, it needs to go north and west. So I think the first thing we're gonna do is take this, I'm gonna go upper level. Probably do something like that. It's a little bit of a sharp turn, but that's fine. And we're gonna connect that up. There's honestly not that much traffic other than uh, from 13 North to 64 East and uh, vice versa. So I think we can get away with a little bit tighter of turns and uh, not so smooth things. Uh, so anyway, that's good, that's good, that's good. Now all we need to do is uh, hook up 64 West, which shouldn't be too difficult. Looks like we can have just a couple upper levels, uh, or second level flyovers to hook up. So, uh, let me, let's see. So the only one that's a little bit tight on space is going to 64 East. Um, but there's a couple of different ways we could hook it up. So first thing I want to do is go upper and hook into right there. It's not the, the best thing, but it's fine. We're going to uh, branch off, come around here, and then hook up onto that ramp. And then we're going to branch off yet again and hook up to 64 East. And let's see how that runs. But yeah, so there's really not that much traffic going from the other direction. So yeah, that ran really smoothly. No slowdowns, pretty good uh, traffic flow speed. And uh, 317. <laughs> and the score to beat is 500. Um, I'm a little surprised at how, how high the score for this is. Um, we could possibly do like a roundabout uh, that hooks up 64 West and 13 South. Uh, we may come back to this one, but I want to kind of get going through the uh, levels, actually get something done this time. All right, so let's check this one out. We've got 64 West sending a lot of traffic to the two commercial areas, let's call them. 64 East also wants to send most of its traffic to the commercial areas. And then there's just a very small amount of traffic that's continuing on uh, 64 from, <clears throat> from east to west, west to east. Our commercial areas want to send traffic in both directions, but also connect to each other. So, I think the first thing we're going to do... Uh, yeah, I think we're going to come forward here and start a bridge. Oh, I just realized this also crosses over. Ah. Oh, oh, oh. Wanted to clear that. 
still hard to get these roads nice and smooth, especially if you're trying to do things quickly. So we'll do that. Bring that down a little bit. And come around this way. Uh, it's definitely not the best thing, but yeah, oh, that's going to be a problem. Um, let's see. Um, let's actually go across. Oh god, that's terrible. They're gonna, yep, they're gonna intersect with each other. Okay, I gotta redo this. Let's just go ahead and clear it. That was not very good. Ah, uh, no, it's doing it again. I think it may have just messed it up. Yeah, I'm not seeing any more blue cars. I am so tired of this game clicking the wrong thing that I'm trying to build. It's very aggravating. So now we have to do this. And I don't think there's enough room here. God, that's terrible. That's gonna hurt us. Well, it didn't jam up, but 145 is not very good. We're gonna clear it. I wanna try this again. And we're complete. Let's see if we can get over 200. Clear it one more time. I'm really not sure uh, how to keep them from interfering with each other so much. Yeah, you can see how bad it is. Just everything interferes with each other. Ooh, it almost jammed. And that was even worse of a score. Ah, uh, man, this one's kind of hard, too. I mean, we were able to complete it, but not happy with how it's turning out. Maybe if I do something a little bit different here. All right. I want to take this down here. Cross over. Hook it up. Um, I want this to come around like this, go down a level, and then hook it up. Have an exit going this way. So that's going to go that way, I think. We'll hook up there. <clears throat> and it'll still need something going the other way. Hmm. Not a lot of room. It's sending, yeah, it's not the best. I maybe should have started it back here. Uh, let's see, where can I cross this over? So let's take this. That's a sharp turn. Oh God. Oh my God, why is this level so hard? Doesn't want to cooperate. Yep, this is not gonna work. Yeah, it's already backed up. This is kind of confusing. I'm not really sure what I should be doing here. You know what? We're gonna be stupid for a moment. I already know this is probably not going to work, but I want to see what happens. Um, so from over here, I need to go up.
Um, and then I guess. Oh no, I've messed that up. Whoops. Why? Why did? I, oh my god. <laughs> why? Ugh. Yeah, these levels. Never that. <laughs> We had a strong beginning to this episode, but, um, yeah, as you can see, stuff gets pretty difficult. If I can't get it on this next try or two, uh, I'm probably just going to move on to the next one because we have designs that work, uh, not a good flow rate, but they do work. And I just kind of want to get through the, uh, levels, see what they look like. Maybe we'll have some better luck on whatever the next one is. Alright, so we've got... Uh, incoming for there, so that's good. And we need the incoming on this side. We have something like that. Pick that up. Pick that up. Actually, probably don't even need a roundabout on this side. I don't think it really helps much of anything. But, got it anyway. Alright, so now our exits. Uh, kind of need... Mm. I don't like it. Yeah, our exits are going to have to be a third level stack above this. Oh god, what? That's weird. Glitched a little bit there. Um, so that still needs a connection over there. You can see just how slow traffic is moving through this. Yeah, we did not need a dumbbell at all. That, that's completely useless. Uh, oh my god. It's so difficult. I did kind of like that idea though. I mean, I could probably... Nope, okay. You know what? I'm done with this level. Moving on. Oh, this is pretty easy. Just a, um... Sort of a, uh... Yeah, it's gonna be like a parallel junction. That's not too hard. Basically, just gonna. Okay, thanks, game. Thanks for hiccuping there for a second. Basically, we just take these, hook them up to each other, and then we just have to hook uh, the upper and lower freeways together. So, West only cares about going to Industrial Road. One B only wants to go to one east. No, nope, stop trying to build. Industrial's going to west. So everything's just sort of crossing over each other. You don't have to do any um, switches or anything or uh, turnarounds. So you can probably go down here. First, mm, I don't leave that much room there. All right. Yeah, it's not the best there. I could have done something a little smoother, but that's good now. That needs to go that way. 
That needs to go that way. Hmm. I should have left that down a little bit so I can get a cross there. Uh, we're gonna clear it real quick. Alright. Let's try this again. So, over here. I want that to come down. I want that to go... Let's start down here. So we want it to be like that. We want this over here. Come down. Back up. And down. And then we need to basically do the same thing with one east and industrial road. Now, now that I'm looking at this though, because there's so little traffic uh, going between the two sides or the two parallel freeways, we could honestly put a roundabout in here and hook it up that way. Uh, but we're gonna do this and see what kind of score we get first. So I can't fit under there. Uh, I'm a little tight on space. Oh no, don't tell me I messed up. Okay, I think it's just a graphic glitch there. Uh, and then the last thing we need is um, one east going down to one B. Which is a little bit difficult. We didn't leave that much room, but I think we can squeeze it right through here. Forward one more. Although I think that's. No, it's not interfering, I don't think. So yeah. That one's not too hard. It just depends on how uh, efficient you want to make it. So we got 355. I might go back later and try that with just a roundabout in here. Uh, see if we get a higher score. But 355 is pretty good. So we're going to go ahead and move on. <clears throat> oh, and so here we've got another fairly simple interchange. Uh, I think it's just called like a split interchange. Um, we do have this 101 junction down here that makes it a little bit more difficult. But honestly, because it's the 101 is not hooking up to the 13 or 13 bypass. Uh, or, oh, that's weird. So yeah, it's the 13 continues from left to right, but then the bypass is on the northern side. But yeah, so the 101 junction just connects to uh, 13 west, basically, is what this should be. So this should be pretty simple. A pretty simple setup. You just sort of connect straight across. Uh, straight across this way. I actually should have left a little more room in there, but that's fine. And as you can see, the bypass is flipped, so we've got our outbound on the left-hand side. <clears throat> which is a little annoying, but it's not bad because we can just kind of do this. We can take this, go up, down, hook it up. And all that's left is the 101 junction, which can just go up and around. It's not the most efficient, but um, that's fine. This should work fine. Yeah. A little bit of a slowdown where stuff is merging right there on the 13 bypass, but 307, that's pretty good. Uh, I could definitely come back in and make this just a little bit more efficient. Probably get up to about 350 or so, but another pretty easy map actually, so we're gonna go ahead and move on. This looks a little more complicated. Uh, that's on oh, that's only outbound, so that's nice. <clears throat> so 101 West is not even going to Industrial Road, it's only going to 101 Junction, 101 East and uh, the industrial area. 
The industrial's going there, 101 E. Oh, so this is really simple. Nothing's going there except that. That's really easy. <clears throat> we need a major connection this way. And just go ahead and do that over here as well. With a flyover for the industrial area. Gonna go ahead and add a little offshoot here for the 101. And then all we need is a hook up here. Uh, again, this is so oh. oh yeah, so this still needs it to uh, get wrapped around. But, whoops, that's not too bad. Basically just gonna come across like this. And down. Hook it up. And then over here, this can basically just come around like this. And hook up. And there we go, network is complete. Yeah, not very much traffic. This one was actually another easy one, surprisingly. 395, it's pretty good. Again, if we made things a little smoother, probably could compact a bit of this, save some concrete, uh, maybe get our average speeds up higher, get a little higher score, but 395 is pretty good. And we are blowing through the right-hand side of this map. I know for a fact, uh, the stuff in these first four on the left are pretty difficult. They took me a long time to mess around with, and I could only barely pass like one or two of them, but the score was extremely low, like only 80 or something. Uh, so when I come back to those, uh, that's going to be interesting to see if I can figure those ones out. Uh, we still have this corner up here that was being a bit difficult. We had one layout that actually got us a score and got us through the whole thing. Uh, but I might play around with that a little bit on my own and see if I can get something that works there. Because that one was uh, a little tricky. Uh, let's try and get one more in here. Uh, yeah, we're doing a little okay on time here. Uh, ooh, this one's got quite a few connections. Um, let's see. Hmm. Yeah, this one's gonna be difficult. Uh, we could probably do... Honestly, I wanna just try roundabout first. I know it's not gonna work. There's gonna be way too much traffic for it. But... We have a lot of traffic going a lot of places, so we don't have too many options. Or at least not too many, um, I should say like, stock options, not making uh, custom interchanges. Which I guess that's what this is all about, but you know, try and make our lives easier if we can. <clears throat> Uh, so I want to double check something here. Alright, so we've got a lot from the 101 going west. So we're probably going to do a bypass for that. That's not a lot of traffic. This is sending a little more traffic. So there's a possibility... Well, they're only the next exit. So we should be okay there if I do this. Uh, and then that needs to go down. <clears throat> Actually, I'm going to do something different for that. So I'm going to leave it as it is for right this moment. Right, so that needs an exit over there. That's sending a little bit more traffic. That's sending quite a bit of traffic. Uh, so let's do that. Right, so that's hooked up that way. Um, yeah, okay, so now what I want to do here uh, I could have left myself a little more room here and saved some concrete by not having to do a third level interchange, but oh well and then we go down, that's going to interfere 100% I already know it, so we're just going to go ahead and redo this I kind of want to do something like that, a little bit more. That way I can do that so I can get underneath it. 
then back down. Just gonna hook that up. Go up. And go up. Down. Connect that up. Uh, let's see. So west is pretty even traffic. So the west just needs to go there. Uh, east still needs it. That is good. And the 101 needs a connection. Okay, so let's see, where can we add these? Okay, we have to make a dedicated line for blue to get across this. So that should help alleviate that, except that this is probably going to cause a problem right here. Uh, let's watch this yellow one, and yep, they cross over, so that's not helpful. Hopefully it won't be too much of a problem, but I bet it will be. I, I just know it will be. Oh wait, that doesn't help me. Oh, crap. Uh, what am I missing though? Oh, just my on-ramp for, uh, 101 East. Mm, there's not that much room for it. Possibly go up there. Oh, this is terrible. Did another bad one. Oh yeah, look how bad that is, and it's jamming up right there, and... Oh god, 78, that's terrible. Let's clear it, get rid of it. Don't wanna see it. Um, instead of doing a roundabout, let's just see what happens if we try and uh, hook some stuff up correctly, or uh, directly, I should say. And all we need is the 101 West to get hooked up. But I, <laughs> I honestly don't think this is going to work. Oh, there's like no room left. We've got to be dangerously low on concrete. Try and go up. Yep, and out of concrete. So yeah, we've got to do a uh, roundabout. There's just no other way. Now it's possible a dumbbell interchange could work here better. Uh, just because there's so many connections and a lot of them are just going to the next one. So that's something we could potentially, potentially need. That's good. This needs a direct hookup this way. And then we're going to have this exit over here. Alright, so that's good. 101 East needs some stuff. Go up and around and back down. 101 West. Oh, I did not leave myself enough room here. 
That's crap. Oh man, you can see the car's jittering and stuff because that messed up. Well, yep, I already know that's gonna hurt us. That's fun. Let's hook this up. Oop, what is... Oh, okay, right there. It's easy enough to fix. And then that's gonna go up. That's good. That still needs a thing. Do that. Oh, there's so many things to hook up. Crap. Let's see how bad this is. And jamming up just a little bit. Okay, now it's starting to jam up a lot. Uh, there's definitely a better way to do this one. Um, yeah, you can see how bad it's jamming up. But, uh, yeah, I mean, could add more flyovers and direct routes and things. Stuff is getting caught right here because of the, the level, like, bug glitch thing. So it's not very good. Got cars jittering around up there, but... I've spent way too much time on a couple of these levels. So that is going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe, share this with your friends, and I'll catch all of you in the next video.